Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you top 10 must-have applications for Galaxy Note 4. I will be showing you applications to utilize S Pen, that big screen, and to add a lot of new features to your device. The download link and the timestamp of all of these applications are below in the description box. So the first application on the list is S Pen Toolbox. This application gives you extra control over S Pen. This application allows you to change a lot of things when you attach or detach S Pen. Whenever you detach S Pen, here below, you'll get a box with applications, shortcuts and accents like going to home or to take a screenshot. You can choose what items you want here by long pressing here. You can choose to add applications, shortcuts or accents also. Then you can set to launch a specific application when S Pen is detached like a node. There are options for a shortcut and some accents as well. Then you can choose to turn off screen when S Pen is attached or you can choose to go to the home screen. And you can even play a tone when S Pen is detached or attached to let you know. So these little features can be very useful, especially that app list. So the next application on the list is My Script Stylus. This application lets you to write instead of typing. It's a handwriting recognition application and allows real-time conversion of handwritten text into digital text. The recognition is very good and it uses various gestures to edit the text. Like, you can join the text, split it, or insert a word in between. You can easily erase a character or a word. On the top here, you will see suggestions displayed and tapping it will replace the word. There is a slider below to navigate through your writing. For some, this method might be very fast and convenient as well. If you want to type with your hand and prefer a normal keyboard, you can easily change it from this notification here, which appears every time you are typing. And there's many languages to choose from as well. So if you are a note user, I would definitely recommend to try this application once. The next application on the list is SD Made. After using your phone for a while, there will be various unuseful files and leftovers in your device. SD Made does a great job cleaning those while providing other useful tools. As you open this application, it analyzes your phone, giving you its current status. Then there is App Control that will show you list of running applications and also show you list of applications that are scheduled to start at boot. Corpse Finder scans for files of application that are no longer installed so you can delete it. Then there is System Cleaner which scans for files that can safely be deleted. The App Cleaner scans internal and external SD cards to clean application cache. Then below you'll find a list of files showing amount of volume it has occupied on your system. So that's all about this application. There are some very useful cleaning and monitoring tools in this application. The next application on the list is Pixel Battery Saver. Note 4's battery life is great, but this application has unique features to extend that battery life even further. In smartphones with AMOLED screen, black pixels means that pixel is turned off and it's not consuming any battery. So what this application does is it turns off some pixel in the screen so that less energy is being consumed while you will still be able to read everything on the screen. Check this out if you don't understand. As Note 4 has AMOLED screen, it will benefit from this application. I do not recommend to turn it on every time but when your battery is low, this application will really help to get more screen time from remaining battery. There are 5 different levels to turn off pixel. Lowest means there are fewer pixels that have been turned off and as you go below, the number of black pixels will increase. As you can see in these pictures, this application will help you to get more screen time when needed without disabling any features. This application adds a layer on top of the screen due to which the install button doesn't work while installing APK files. Everything else does but the install button doesn't work. Disabling this application at that moment will fix the problem. 
The next application on the list is Photoshop Touch. This application is designed for bigger screens and comes with core elements from the desktop version. Using S Pen for editing adds even more precision. There are many powerful tools inside this application. Here you will find some basic tools for selection, cut, copy and some tools to make adjustments in photos like brightness, saturation and many more. Then there are lots of tools to apply effects on your photo. And at last some tools to crop, rotate and add text and many more. Here you will find some desktop tools like selection tool with various modes, magic wand tool, pen tool and clone stamp tool. And from here you can manage layers. There is also a refine as option allowing you to precisely select the area you want. So that's all about this application. This application provides very powerful tools to edit your pictures. The next application on the list is S Pen Voice. This application won first prize in Samsung App Challenge. It's specially for students but others can also benefit from this application. It lets you to record and take notes at the same time, which will be very useful in lectures and even in interviews. To take one, you need to enter subject and choose a background. Above, you will find eraser and options to change space. While replaying it, so it's presented as a video page wise. Note 4 has 3 mics built in with directional voice recording so you will be able to get better clear audio from it. The next app on the list is LastPass. LastPass is a password manager application and uses Notes for fingerprint scanner for extra security. You just need to go to this application, add a login info. Then whenever any application requires that login info again, LastPass detects it and after verification, you will be able to use it. Adding a site is very easy. Go to add site, add details and it's done. It also has a password generator, so you can use it to generate passwords for extra security. The next app on the list is PushBullet. PushBullet is a great way to connect your Note 4 with your computer. You just need to install an extension in your browser. Every notification you receive on your phone will be displayed in your computer. Calls, messages, app notifications, anything. From settings, you can disable some applications if you want to. Apart from notification, you can send a link, photo or a file, a message from PC to mobile. Same thing can be done from mobile to PC as well. If you have multiple devices, you can share information between them with few taps. With the help of other applications, you can also reply to a SMS from PC. So that's all about this application. It's a great way to connect your phone with PC and other devices. The next app on the list is Papyrus. Papyrus is a very good note taking application, especially when it comes to handwritten notes. At the main screen, it will give you options to organize notes and to create a new one just like in any other. At the top and bottom, you will find plenty of easy to understand options. Options to undo or redo, a tool picker which has a pen tool, allowing to choose thickness and this application also has pressure detection built in so it will take advantage of that very accurate sensitivity in Note 4 and below there are options to choose between various styles. Then the selection tool so you can replace, copy any element in the paper. Then you have eraser tool and shape tool. Then at last, text tool. Color picker is there to change the paint's color. You can easily export the notes as a PDF file within this application. So that's all about this application. This application, it's a simple app to take handwritten notes. The next application on the list is Infinite Walls. This application has a lot of amazing wallpapers. The designs are really good and all wallpapers supports 2K display which our Note 4 has. There are a lot of different categories all housing amazing wallpapers. The button over here will allow you to download this wallpaper to your gallery or set it as a wallpaper directly. So that's all about this application. There are a lot of amazing high resolution wallpapers in this application.
so just give it a try. So that's all about this video. Hope you guys have found some applications for yourselves and if you know of any other application, do let me know in the comment section below. And subscribe for more videos on Note 4 and follow me on social medias. Thanks for watching and see you guys next time.